Good morning. Uh, it's a great honor to be here and see many familiar friends and faces and friends and colleagues. As a new chair and curator of anthropology and a Licky grantee and a speaker series participant of the foundation, it's a great pleasure uh, and honor to welcome you all to this scientific round table. I also welcome you to this new academy which is now housed in this magnificent building which I think you'll agree. The LSB Leakey Foundation, which is celebrating its 40th anniversary, is honoring two extraordinary scientists whose contribution to the field as well as to the, follow, to the generations that followed uh, that contributed to the, to the emergence of many researchers as well. I wish to congratulate the foundation, Drs. Jane Goodall and Toshisada Nishida on this occasion in the name of the, the Academy and everybody here. The foundation strives to increase scientific knowledge and public understanding of human origins, evolution, behavior, and survival. This are also among the diverse questions addressed by the California Academy of Sciences. The foundation's long-standing commitment to the, to the scientific inquiry, investment of in scientists of the future, and public programs resonate deeply with the Academy's own mission. A partnership between the two organizations is not only natural, but also a, power way, a powerful way to communicate the relevance and implications of human origins research to the public at large. We must and will strive to strengthen this partnership at different levels in order to achieve our common goals. Primatology is not only a field of research in which cutting edge discoveries about great apes and other primates are made, but also a discipline that occupies a special place with regard to behavioral studies of homo sapiens and human ancestors. As we all know, a great deal of behavioral information on extinct hominid species can be extracted from the fossil and archaeological record. Using this line of evidence, anthropologists have been able to articulate our knowledge of hominin anatomy, diet, diet, and locomotor repertoire to bear on our understanding of fossil hominin behavior and their interactions with other species and their environment in general. Nonetheless, a more complete comprehension of humans and extinct human ancestors cannot be attained without a good understanding of modern, beha beha modern primate behavior, specifically that of our closest relatives, the great apes. In the absence of modern analog for the many extinct hominin species represented today just by Homo sapiens, taxa such as Pan paniscus, Pantrogridites, and Gorilla gorilla serve as the most appropriate interpretive models for investigating the behavioral context of our species and ancestors. What makes us human today cannot be fully understood if we do not explore what makes us apes or primates. Our uniqueness as a species is to be found by searching for the commonalities that we share with the primate species, especially the great apes. It is therefore critical to bring such an eminent group of researchers together and delve into the many key questions about our cousins, the primates. This is indeed a great and rare opportunity for many of us, and we look forward to your presentations and discussions. Again, welcome and thank you, and I would like to take this occasion to introduce Dr. Sandy Harcourt to introduce the next speaker. Dr. Harcourt, Dr. Harcourt is from the University of Davis and he is a primatologist. Thank you.